The next enhancement we're going to talk about is enhancement to our five axis module in here. And I'm going to uh, bring in a couple of examples in here to go with that as well. And we'll take a look at uh, some of the enhancements to our five axis toolpath methods. Now one of the uh, new enhancements that we've added in five axis methods and this uh, option is available in our premium configuration. Uh, we could now lock one of the axes in, in five axis to a four axis. So, and this is available in all of these methods except the drive curve machining. So as you select one of these methods, you will notice that under cut parameters, you now have the ability to lock it to a four axis uh, versus programming a full five axis or a true five axis. Now a lot of parts similar to these can be programmed on a four axis machine using the true four axis method. So the five axis toolpath methods that you see here now offers you the ability to lock one of the axes in so you can program this as a, a true four axis operation in here by locking one of the rotational axes in here. So you'll now notice that the tool remains normal to the rotational at the surface being machined by locking one of the axes in here. And I'm going to go ahead and run a verification in here on this particular operation and we'll switch over to one of the side views so you will notice that the tool motion by looking at it you can tell that it's locking one of the axes in so you can program this as a true four axis so you don't really need to have a five axis machine tool but you can accomplish these on a four axis machine by taking advantage of this ability to lock one of the axes in in our premium configuration of the product. Yeah, this actually opens up an entire class of parts that you can machine. Uh, things like what they're showing here, handrails uh, with twisted handrails uh, for you know staircases and things of that sort, chair handrails. A lot, a lot of furniture makers use this kind of geometry shapes. And you don't need to have a five-axis machine. Uh, you can machine these now with these options that we have put in for, uh, I believe, the five methods there in, in the five-axis uh, panel. Uh, so quite a, quite a few methods for you to utilize on your uh, four-axis machine. You don't need a five-axis machine to use our premium product anymore. Thanks for that. Thank you, Joe.